Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have these three phones. That is, this is the Nexus 5, this is the Samsung Galaxy S S4, that is the Exynos Octaco version. And this is the Note 3 Neo that has a six core processor, again made by Samsung Exynos. And we're going to test how hot these phones do become uh, when they are stressed. And to test that, uh, we'll be run, running some benchmarks on them. I'll run it for five minutes and uh, uh, we'll test the, what do you say? Let's first run Antutu on all of them and let's see uh, what are the temperatures. And then we'll run a 3D mark in a loop for about 10 minutes and see uh, what happens. And uh, we're going to time it. So before starting the test, let's look at the temperature. This is the temperature here outside. It's 28.3 degrees. And on the Nexus 5, it's showing as 29.5 on the s4 actually it's pretty high as you can see it's 30.5 and this is the uh, note 3 neo about uh, 29.5 same as nexus so let's start this uh, with antu 2 we'll run antu 2 on all of these and i'll also start this uh, st stopwatch over here and we're going to start the test so now we are reaching the one minute mark and uh, let me take the temperatures now uh, the nexus is uh, still showing just 29.5 so it did not increase a lot on the other hand the s4 has increased a little bit about 32 degrees centigrade and this neo is 30.2 so nexus 5 uh, is the coolest as of now and now we are close to almost three minutes mark let me just feel the devices first it feels slightly uh, warm. This is the S4 and this is actually pretty warm. This is also not that uh, warm. So let's look at the temperatures. Nexus 5 is showing 32.5. Uh, actually S4 as you can see it was pretty hot. 36.6 degrees centigrade. So pretty hot. Uh, the benchmark is still going on uh, on this uh, Note 3 Neo. Just finished and this is also 32.8 so the s4 was pretty hot so this test is done and we'll just get out of this one and we'll kill that don't want anything running in the background and now we'll run this 3d mark on all these three devices and let me reset the clock now and we're going to run the ice Storm extreme uh, on these devices and start 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 and start and uh, we'll start comparing the temperature after a minute after three minutes and when it's done so let's look at the temperatures it's been uh, just a minute so let's see on the nexus 5 35.6 this is significantly hotter 37.8 uh, the new we are getting 36 so again we'll look at look at the temperatures after about two minutes and it's 2 minutes 55 seconds uh, let me just uh, look at the devices uh, the nexus 5 actually feels a bit warm i'll also start taking the temperature at the back where they feel warm uh, the s4 this is also feels warm not very hot but surprisingly this is doing the benchmark the slowest uh, and this also does not feel that much warm so let's look at the temperatures now uh, nexus uh, 36.3 on the front screen and at the back actually it's pretty hot at back as you can see it's almost 43 degrees celsius that's pretty hot uh, let's look at s4 screen it's about 37 degrees celsius pretty hot and at the back actually uh, about 41 uh, degrees celsius not as hot as the nexus 5 and uh, let's look at note 3 neo that's about 37 degrees on screen and on back about 40 so uh, surprisingly the nexus was the hottest the back is going pretty hot as you can see 46 degrees celsius near that camera area it actually becomes very hot so again we'll look at the temperatures in a few minutes now it's at 6 minutes 45 seconds the benchmarking was done i again uh, re-ran it and now let's uh, look at it uh, the nexus actually uh, at the back it looks pretty hot uh, let's see the temperature uh, screen temperature not that bad 35.6 but that back is still hovering around that 44 degrees uh, celsius let's look at the s4 now uh, it's 36 on the screen and back 
actually around 40 uh, degrees Celsius, 41, I would say, 41, 42, 41.5. Uh, and this is the Note 3 Neo. Uh, screen not that bad, about uh, 35. Uh, top it's a little bit more. Oops, the screen went off. No, it's there. About screen at the top, it is actually a lot hotter, about 41. So this area is getting pretty warm. And on the back, also we have, it's about 42 degrees Celsius. So pretty warm, I would say. Let's look at the screen temperature. Yes, even the S4 actually near this uh, Samsung logo, if you uh, put, it's actually pretty hot, about 41 degrees Celsius. Let's see Nexus. Yes. So uh, actually near the earpiece, all these devices are getting pretty hot. As you can see, 42.8 degrees Celsius, that is uncomfortable. Lower down, it's not that hot. So we'll see S4, again the same thing, about 41. The down you go, it uh, falls down. 42 at the top, down about 33. So all of these devices can get uh, pretty uncomfortably hot. It's about eight minutes. We'll do this for about two more minutes and we'll see the temperatures. And it's nine minutes, 45 seconds. The benchmarking on Nexus 5 is done. So again, as you can see at the top, it's pretty hot, about 42 degrees centigrade. And at the back, again, it went to almost 44, 46. So pretty hot actually. Uh, Note 3 Neo also finished. Still the Galaxy S4 is lagging. Uh, about 40 degrees centigrade at the top and at the bottom about 35 to the screen and on the back also let's look that's about 40 uh, so nexus wise was pretty hot uh, this is the galaxy s4 and this is also actually pretty hot 41.5 degrees uh, centigrade as you can see and on the back also this can become pretty hot it's about 40 degrees Celsius. So both uh, the Nexus 5 and the Galaxy S4 can become uncomfortably hot. Uh, let's also just look at the scores. We are not for the benchmarks, but on the Note 3 Neo, we got a score of 5,239. On the actually Galaxy S4, this is the octa-core version uh, that uses the Exynos chip. Uh, relatively uh, low score of just 3,132. I also noticed that Two times I ran the benchmark, uh, this was the slowest in this graphic benchmark. And uh, what do you say, this uh, Nexus 5, it says it's maxed out. So that's an amazing score. So again, both these Nexus 5 and the Galaxy S4, if you stress them, uh, they can become uncomfortably hot. The temperatures would have gone even higher. It is just that I'm in an AC uh, room. That's why uh, otherwise at least a couple of degrees centigrade, it would have been higher. And yes, uh, these high-end devices can get actually pretty hot and uncomfortable when they are stressed. In fact, from my day-to-day -day experience uh, using the Nexus 5 and the Galaxy S4, I would say both these devices can get actually pretty warm even while using them normally for about five to six minutes outdoors. So I would like to see manufacturers just concentrate a little bit more uh, about the temperature issues on these modern day smartphones. I hope that you found this uh, video helpful. If you found it helpful, I'll appreciate if you can click the like button. Thank you. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.